In this video, I'll show you how to set branding for an organization. By default, branding is inherited from its parent organization. To set branding, select the organization, the Settings tab, the Branding tab, and the Custom Branding radio. Logo is what is displayed when a user logs into the web portal. The splash screen is displayed when a user logs into the mobile app. The icon is displayed in the sys tray, desktop icon, explorer, and registration wizard. Here you enter the company name and the company URL. The program name is what the installer is called and also what is displayed in the program files folder. The folder name is what the synced folder is called. This is where users will put files that they want to sync to the cloud. Here's where you can enter your own custom terms of service. After all the settings are set, select Save. Here are the places where branding is displayed. It is important to note that if you change branding, any agents with the old branding have to be uninstalled and reinstalled for it to take effect. That concludes our video on branding. Thank you for watching.